Well, it's a fabulous Friday, and we're here in Miss Miller's class with them. Good morning. Good morning, morning Miss Thacker. Oh, we are so delighted to be here this morning. Uh, I first of all want to talk to the students about breakfast. Um, one of the things we really need to work on during breakfast time is if you get up and go get a tray, there is so much talking going on through the lines that it's sometimes hard for us to hear out in the cafeteria. And we're still needing to work on those procedures of at 7.55 being our focus time. But anyway, I know this is the second week of school and next week will be fabulous. So at this time, we're in Miss Dunlap's, Miss Miller's room. I know I was gonna do that. Uh, and I'm gonna turn this over to her, one of her students. Share the mic and talk about what we made and why we made them. Uh, we made these little eye cans, and whenever a student says they can't do something, then Miss Miller will tell them to point to the eye on the can and then point to the can and then say, I can. I, I, oh, and um, we can have them on our desk so that when we're looking at it, we can um, so I was actually um, at a service on Sunday and they were talking about building each other's character up and making sure that you were living your life with the I cans in your life and they were talking about a teacher who had a group of students who sometimes struggle to believe in themselves and they a lot of times said I can't I can't I can't right so Ms. Miller told all the students to bring a can to school. They all brought a can, wondering why. And then the next day, each student was to stand up and hold their can in the air and explain something that they could do. For example, Car or uh, Davion, can you hold your can up and show us something you can do? Tell us something you can do. I can chocolate. All right. Aiden, can you tell us something you can do? I can make tacos. Good. Woo! Tell us something you can do. I can love my teacher with all my heart. <laughs> That's the best. <laughs> um, but anyway, so they each thought of something they could do, and then they turned their cans into little monsters, and we kept them on their desk. The next day, before we went home, I told the students to bring me a can. And they all just kind of looked at me like I was crazy, and they kept kind of looking around at each other for advice and help. And I said, well, just bring me an I can't, something from home. Bring me a can't. And the... The verdict to that was there is no such thing as a what? Can. Because we are I can kids. Thank you. I thought this was fabulous. And they are actually going to get an opportunity to be in a newspaper article uh, from the Log Cabin Democrat. Miss Miller had sent a picture and I posted on Facebook. And so uh, the newspaper contacted me from seeing that picture and said, can you tell us more about this? So Miss Miller wrote a little article. And I don't know if it's going to be in the the newspaper or just the online version called School Zone, but we want to be watching for that because I thought that was fabulous. And I'm just going to do a shout out. I got some absolutely wonderful pictures from several teachers yesterday and all week. Some super fun, engaging, interactive things going on in your classrooms. And I just want to give you a huge shout out, teachers, for for just allowing our parents and our community to see what fabulous things we have going on in our classroom. So thank you, thank you, thank you. I'll turn it back over to Ms. Becker. I'm glad you brought that up, Ms. Bertram, because I don't Facebook very often, but last night when I got on, it was just like, I was just the happiest principal in the whole world to see all of the wonderful learning activities that were going on here at Ida Burns. Well, if nothing else, what's your job today? To get the education. You can. You can. Do it. Whatever you it can is. do it. Have a great day. Bye. Bye.